doesn't have to do by theory or textbook. Most important is by visual aid or model instruments and tools. There is tools and tools that There is introducing new designs Graha Teknologi Sriwijaya, or in short, people call it as Gratex, and also people name it as Museum Teknologi, or Technology Museum, is a knowledge and science center in South Sumatra. This museum has many science visual aid or model instruments. Museum Teknologi is proper as Taman Pintar in Yogyakarta, and in Taman Mini Indonesia Indah in Jakarta. Graha Teknologi Sriwijaya was officially on December 9, 2004 by Ministry of Research and Technology, Insinyur Kusmayanto Kadiman, PhD. This Graha is Department Technical Organizer Unit Property by Education Department South Sumatra Province. This is one of the science centers in Indonesia. Some science competitions is held in this museum such as between teachers, students, and schools. In 2014, Graha Teknologi Sriwijaya held some workshop or training and contest or competition. Robotic science assembling for junior high school and elementary school levels. Workshop the making of astronomy visual instruments for junior high school teachers and workshop the making of science media learning that best on information technology for senior high school teachers. Meanwhile, for some competitions, which are robotic contests for elementary school, water robotic region for junior high school, great creation of visual instruments innovation contest based on lakas material for senior high school teachers, and color contest for kindergarten and early childhood students. This museum is located in Sliman Amri Yahya Street, Taman Budaya Site, Jakabaring, Palembang City, South Sumatra. Graha Technology Sriwijaya Building has one shape. This museum has three floors with big windows and rotate every floor. So from the outside, this place seems like a class door. Some supporting facilities there are like a musola, canteen, science laboratory, and administration room. There are also science workshop, water rocket, astronomy lesson, and agro-science for children. Many interesting spots in this museum. There are around like 160 visual instruments which consist of machine and non-machine. Every year, the visual instruments keep increased more and more. For example, hop without wings and bed of spikes and many more. Why people go there? Go to the Graha Technology Sriwijaya. By visiting this place, people will feel how to study science by instruments, by various kinds of interactive visual aids and model instruments, and educational program, along with various activities that create interestingly. This place is amazing and attract people to learn about science. 
penyakit menular Sriwijaya Zoo is one of the science centers in Indonesia. This museum is used as a tool of science knowledge and technology outside the school activity, or also can take as additional learning program which is given to the visitors, especially for children and science until college students. workshops, learning in the field of handicraft, especially for children, science creativity in exhibition, South Sumatra Student Science Festival, workshop, science competition, uh, competence between students, teachers, and schools, national rocket water competitions, uh, DCLAT or seminar or workshop, roadshow providing science learning to schools in the sub-districts or cities, astronomy, observing stars and other celestial objects, robotic. This museum is much used by teachers and schools to educate the students about science. So, no wonder why this place will be crowded even on school time, because some of them have their lesson class in here.
What will you see in this museum? In here, you will see many science stuff and find out more about science visual aid and instruments. You can try those science instruments who will lead by the museum guard or officer. You will never feel so real when you learn science without trying the instruments. One of the most wonderful visual aids that I try is harpa tanpa dawai, or in English maybe you can call it a harp without the wires or a harp without strings. This music instrument, even though it doesn't have string, but it still can be played. Is that amazing? Do you wanna see it? Okay, let's see. How much cost is needed to enter this museum? Well done, it's pretty cheap about 3,000 rupees. Can you believe it? 